Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're opening up this $150 mystery box from Pop King Paul, so stick around. Like I said in the intro, today we are opening up this $150 mystery box from Pop King Paul. So this is the first time I've ever purchased from Pop King Paul and I'm really, really excited to open up this box because I've seen nothing but uh, great reviews for the service and great reviews on the boxes, so I'm pretty excited about it. But before we get into that, take a second guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below, give me a thumbs up, hit the share button, share it with a friend, tell somebody, let's get that subscriber count jumping up and uh, help your boy out, right? So um, yeah, the big like hits or the big grails on this are gonna be up on the screen right now. And the ones that I'm personally excited about would be the, I mean, I was excited about the Monsters 4 pack, but I don't think judging by the size of this box, uh, we got that one. But my fingers are still crossed for an unmasked Jason Voorhees. I've been on the hunt for this thing for a while now. And particularly in the past couple weeks, I've been like sending out offers, trying to pick one up. Uh, as you guys know, eBay numbers are astronomical for that thing. And I, I just, I can't bring myself to spend like $800 on something that's listed at 300 and something on PPG. So um, yeah, we're gonna get right into this thing. Jump on it, open it up and see what we get. Trusty box cutter. Uh, we'll open it from the bottom, see what we get, and uh, show you guys first. Go over all the uh, PPG stuff after the fact. If you guys are brand new here, uh, that's typically how we do the mystery box videos. So, let's try not to look. I don't know how Pop King Paul wraps his boxes, um, but, oh man, it seems like they're all, okay, so they're all in protectors and they were all like kind of together. So, okay, so there's no stacks. So let's just grab one out, show it to you guys and get it cracking. So here's the first pull. All right, cool. So we got a uh, Bruce Lee. This is a bait exclusive. If you guys don't know what bait is, it's actually like a sneaker store out here. They, I mean, they sell uh, vinyl toys too. But um, yeah, it's like a sneaker store out here in Los Angeles. And uh, yeah, this is pretty badass. I mean, I don't collect Bruce Lee, um, but it is definitely a really, really cool figure. It's the uh, gold one. Pretty, pretty rad. Um, this is, I mean, I don't know. I'm gonna have to look up values. Oh, by the way, this was guaranteed $150, guys. So we have at least $150 worth of pops in this box. And um, I think that's based on PPG from when it went on sale, which was a couple weeks ago. So let's see, keep it going. That's the back, here it is. All right, cool, so we have the Tiffany Chase from Bride of Chucky. I actually already have this pop. Uh, you guys probably know that I am a big Chucky fan. So pretty much every single Chucky pop that is in existence, I have, I think with the exception of one. I'm missing one, um, what is it? It is a Hot Topic blood splattered Chucky of some sort. I'll throw a picture up right here, but I know that they have a couple different Hot Topic ones, um, but that's the one I'm missing. So if you guys have it, hit me up and I will gladly take it off your hands. So pop number three, feels like there's six pops in here. So three of six, halfway there, here it is. All right, and it is Hulk Hogan from Walmart. Uh, this is another pop I already have, already have this guy. I mean, it's still a cool piece though. Definitely love this one. I actually have two of these. I have the special edition sticker that I was able to pick up at the uh, Funko Hollywood store back when it was still open. And then I have the Walmart one that uh, I hounded on the Walmart website. If anybody was trying to get these, you know, there was like a huge pain in the ass at first. I think that they're sitting on there now. Like they're just kind of chilling. But man, at first this was such a pain because it kept like restocking randomly and it would only restock a couple of them. And blah, 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 blah. It was such a pain. That along with the Andre the Giant. So uh, cool to have another one, I guess. I don't know. I ordered two. One came thrash, one came looking good. And then I ordered the, uh, uh, and then I purchased the special edition sticker one. So, all right, pop number four, moving on. Here we go. Oh, Harry Potter flocked Cyrus as a dog. So I don't really, uh, I'm not a big Harry Potter fan. I, I don't know what this is worth or if I'm like sitting over here like bitching about something that I probably shouldn't be bitching about. But either way, I'm good on the Harry Potter stuff. 
Uh, let's keep going. Pop number five. Number five is right here. Okay, cool. Another pop that I have. Man, this is like the ultimate, like, I either don't collect it or I already have it box. So this is uh, Death of the Family Joker. Uh, I bought this when it first released at Hot Topic. Uh, probably, I want to say a few months ago, but I mean, who knows? Because it could be a while back now. I mean, I feel like I'm so bad with keeping track of time, especially when things release. So uh, either way, I have that one for sure. Let's get to the last pop in this box. Let's hope that it's something sick, something that I need. And here it is. Ooh, okay, I see the back. And if this is the chase, I'm gonna be really hyped. Oh, it's not, I already have this one. So, I have the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, uh, the Leatherface, and the Pretty Woman Mask. So it looks like that's everything that's in here. So, uh, let's take a closer look at everything that we got, and uh, let's look at some values. And just like I guess, I had no idea what I was talking about. Of course, that Cyrus Black is the dog is like the bigger hit in this box at 55 bucks. Uh, like, it's still not a Harry Potter fan. Doesn't really change how I feel about the pop. So let me know if you guys need that one. And I will definitely be trading it to you or selling to you. Whatever. We'll work something out. Um, but yeah, not a bad box at all. Got a hundred and I think it was $159 in total value off a $150 box. So got exactly what what we planned on right so we spent 160 uh, after shipping it was 150 dollars guaranteed and we only missed out on like a dollar in terms of value so pretty stoked about it definitely got some cool pops in there i mean the bruce lee one is really really rad i don't know if i'll be keeping it but it's still a cool thing to have i'm a completionist so i feel like if i keep one bruce lee i have to then consistently try to find these other ones but we'll see how it goes all right guys as always thank you so much for watching i appreciate every single view that we get on this channel and it means the world so um and make sure you guys check me out on instagram at left coast collects follow me on twitch uh twitch.tv slash left coast collects follow my awesome wife at twitch.tv slash goth posh and follow the best content creators on the internet when it comes to toys the funko collector society at funko collector society on instagram thank you guys i can't express how much it means to me that people give a shit about this channel watch the video so it's pretty awesome and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did leave me a comment down below and let me know where you want me to purchase my next mystery box from and uh i'll pick something from down there and pick something up right uh, i try to only go for these like higher end ones because then you know you're actually going to get something that's worthwhile right um but yeah thank you guys again and we'll catch you guys on the next one peace